Nice dollary. Oops, dropped it. Dollary to start it off. Yeah. Alright guys, it's pretty hard here. I've got a little screwdriver. The coin should be on the surface almost. Now I got dotted with these. The Excalibur will not discriminate against them. Two dollars, three dollars, four dollars, one dollar in the pouch. Put these, put them in the rubbish bin. Alright guys, I've just done over there, just near the pub. Now another good spot is this tan bark round trees. Awesome. Coins just drop in there. People sit around trees. That was the last hole and another two bucker. Nice one. So in the pouch. And we'll keep going. That section's done now, so we'll go do another section. Zipper. Hey guys. All right, so we've, um, we did just over here, just over there, and scored about six bucks there in the garden bed there. I just did over there at the tree there. Uh, two bucks and that tree there absolutely nothing that's just a key now this is possibly a coin because it's a real small ah oh, no dudded myself aluminium pull tab pulled out about i don't know 10 bucks or something out of this little park here so that's pretty cool for just a little park let's go let's go to the next one next job hey guys I'm at uh, Woi Woi Little Kids Park here. Um, there's some kids and mums and dads walking around, so I've gone up and asked them for permission. And uh, they said it's okay to video while they're in the background, so thumbs up for that. Don't forget, always ask if there's people around, just in case they don't want to be in your video. It's not on the top layer. There it is. Can you see it? Can you see it? Awesome. There she blows. Nice two dollary. That's the first two dollars out of all this, which is strange, and that's pretty deep. So people, if someone's been here, they've clearly been time. You don't want to miss coins. So in the pouch. All right. First layer here. Will we see the gold pop up? Don't forget, fill all your holes in nicely. It's out of the hole. Now as you can see, I don't use a pinpointer. Look at that. Don't need a pinpointer to find that. Nice one. Another dollary. Alright. Let's fill that hole up nicely. Beautiful. Alright, so that was alright. We've scored a couple of coins in this corner yet. Now this is where the Bounty Hunter TX4 used to come in handy. It doesn't do that next to all those big steel pipes. But it also doesn't dig two and a half foot. Alright, there's a coin. For sure, Apple Core. Here we go, look, on the surface. Surface popper. Surface popper, love that. Nice one, in the pouch. Love the tan bark. way too big. Now all I can do is take this down the centre bit like that. Now if that went bang 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 you know you got something nice and sharp just here. So let's see if it's on the surface. Yep she's come out. It's right it's in here. It's pretty small. Oh no look. It's a little bubby 
just a little button, aluminium button. Got sucked in, thought it was a coin, scored a button. Oh well, it doesn't matter, that's treasure hunting. We've scored a couple of bucks out of here already, so not too bad. For some reason, there was absolutely nothing up the front here, but in that far corner there, uh, about six bucks. Six bucks more than what we had when we got here. All right, guys, well, that's uh, Woi Woi Little Kitty Park done. I'm gonna go further down there. There's heaps of grass and there's a few more parks down that way. So I'm gonna work my way all the way back. Um, don't forget, I'm only on the push bike because the gearbox is still broken in the car. I hate riding it. Hey guys, so the park's just there, which I just did. Yeah. Normally around this area here, every time I've tried to do something, all I found was crap. Let's have a look. Little brass, pot rivet, and this is what I'm saying, you go, when you come down here, you just find everything boating find a lot of square copper nails down here. Might have to get a digger out. My hands aren't that strong. Oh, look at that. Be really careful when you're digging with your fingers because there's a bit of glass. All right, we'll put that in the bin in a second. All right, I better take my backpack off. Get the digger out. Backpack off. A little digger. Okay. I'll show you what I'm doing. I know you love watching me dig. Now, oh, here we go here, right here. There we go. Nice bit of copper. Compliments from boat. That was it. Alright, two awesome hits here. And it's in the drink, so up goes the shorts. Let's go waterproof, let's go into the water. Where it too? Big chunk of copper or something. Look how sharp that is. Can you see how sharp that is? It's razor sharp. It wasn't the wire, it's not the wire. Look at that copper wire. Let me drag it up off the ground there. Oh look. It's just heaps of this aluminium copper stuff from boats. You just say it. See the bits of copper coming up everywhere? They start to glow. It's more than likely buzzing on these. This is discriminated against with the steel. But see all these little bits of copper coming up? Look at all this, look at this, copper nails, bits of copper, this is what I'm going to find down there, big chunk of that or something, awesome, awesome. Been here for about half an hour and found absolutely nothing, so not very productive at all, so back on the deadly treadly, we'll grab the Excalibur, we'll wash our feet a little bit, and unproductive just here. So if it's unproductive, get out of here. I don't know which one's got me. A little bit confused here. There we go. The old sweeps. Alright, fill the hole in. So that's it. All that just for a... that. Anyway. The sun's going down, so I better track it to this next next park. Which doesn't matter because I've got my headlamps anyway. So I've got lights, so I can still work at night time, so I better get going, guys. pinpoint unneeded not for a bit of coca-cola tap anyway coca-cola tap unlucky 
All right, I'm going to wrap it up from here. And I'm going to go down there to the park, Kitty's Park, the next one, before she gets too dark. All right, guys, hang in there. Hey, guys, well, it's getting dark. I'm down here now at the next park, just down from Woi Woi a bit, little Kitty's Park. It's pretty messy here. People have just left crap here everywhere during the day. There's cans and chips and hats and runners and everything. So anyway, um, all the rubbish I'll get rid of later. Do the nice clean up job for everyone, working for the council for nothing. And uh, going to run over this now and see if we can get some coins. Now I'll know in the first two minutes whether someone's been here or not. So let's go, follow me guys. I'll show you every time I find something. Start off in this corner here. Nice one guys, two, four, six, seven, eight bucks. Eight bucks under that little swing there. That was awesome, nice one. All right guys, I've had to go for the light on the old iPhone 7S and we've got a hit down here, definitely a coin. Poke your little head out Mr. Goldie. There she blows. Two buckers. Another two buckers. Up there. See these? Rings up high on that. Then you go down, it disappears. So it's just grabbing that. Coin for sure. Coin for sure. You can hear you can hear it. It's just banging out. It's just banging out. There we go. Two bucks. Love the tan bark. Everyone loves the tan bark. Yeah. Since we've got a pole here, right, and she's just buzzing big time. What I sometimes do when I'm desperate, when you're desperate, what you do is get this from the edge here and just drag it over your coil. Get it away from all that noisy beeping. And you can just push all that back. It's just, it's just mulch. So, it's getting night time, I'm buggered. It's about seven o'clock at night. I think I got about 20, 30 bucks or something. I don't know till I go home and count it, but I'll go home and I'll show you when I get home. And uh, don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, and uh, jump on GoFundMe. Give us uh, a dollar if you can afford it, because my gearbox is still broken. I'm still riding my push bike, and she's hardcore. I've had a gut full of it. So if you've got any coins sitting at home, nothing to do. I've got 2,000 subscribers, so if everyone gave me a dollar, I'd have two grand. Um, I'm not expecting anyone to give me any money, but if you've got way too much money, send us a dollar. Go fund me. The links are underneath my site. And if you can't find it, just go to GoFundMe. Treasure Hunters New South Wales. Free service for the public. Lost jewellery and that, which we do for free. It's an awesome site to uh, donate to if you can afford it. All right, guys. Hey, thanks guys. for watching. Well, I finally made it home. Uh, on the old deadly treadley and I've got all my finds all washed up and ready to go and have a look so let's have a squizzy you excited well there we go so it was a big day uh, big adventures and a lot of holes dug a lot of parks covered we'll leave that light on and uh, it was a good one for the tillers what do we got 22 bucks there and nine dollars in ones and that one there is a bit of a strange thing. Looks like a bonnet, but a car or something. And the normal crap you get, as you do. And you saw them on the videos. But all in all, awesome. Impressed. Now, while I've got you, I'll just show you this here. They're all me pennies, and I've put motor oil, two stroke oil in there for my boat engine and I'll put oil in there. So it doesn't matter what oil you soak them in. And this is what they come up like. 1959, 1920. So it cleans them up quite nicely. That's not bad going for 
clan in the old penny so there's your little secret there put it in engine oil two-stroke oil nice one works good and she was a big day I enjoyed it on the deadly treadly and uh, good coinage $31 you gotta love that 31 bucks nice one that's about 10 bucks an hour All right, guys, signing off, having a coffee, and I'm going to go to bed.